expunged. Nothing is done to this guy. He had a criminal record to start with. He's in the country on illegal grounds. You have falsely and illegally allowed him in. He commits a crime against a child. He's not prosecuted. It's expunged. In November, get this, in November, Ibarra files an application for employment authorization. And unbelievably, on December the 9th, 2023, it's approved. So this is your policies in action, Mr. Secretary. A criminal is permitted into this country on grounds flatly not permitted, flatly contradictory to the statute. He commits a crime against a child, and then he gets a work permit. He gets a work permit. You want to know why all of the jobs in the last two or three years have gone to illegal migrants? Working people in this country can't get a job. Their unemployment rate's high. Why? Because of things like this. And then what's he do? Well, we all know that in February, he commits the heinous crime against Lake and Riley. Is this a record that you are proud of? Um, uh, Senator, um, you've misstated some facts. I have read from the parole file, which you have said you don't recall, don't have, you miscited. I'm reading from it. It is right here. And I've just, pursuant to the speech and debate clause, I have just read it into the record. And the reason is you have lied repeatedly nice. to yes, Congress. Nice, you have. Nice. And to the American people about this, they deserve to know. And the only way they're going to know is if I tell them. I've just told them. It's in the record now. I've read it verbatim from the parole file. Verbatim. Mm. I just want to know, why did you change your story so often? Why didn't you just answer honestly to Congressman Bishop and Senator Britt? Senator, I am, I am confident that justice will be vindicated in the criminal prosecution of the case. Well, hopefully he'll get more of wow. a trial than you got. Oh. Otherwise, there'd be no justice for anyone at all. Oh, nice. Wow. Here's the thing, though, that strikes me. I appreciate the passion and zeal. Me too. At the hearings. <laughs> but where are they the rest of the time? Where are you? Josh Hawley and... All, Jim Jordan and everybody else when, I don't know, we're talking Speaker of the House and nobody steps up. Or when, you know, there's a, a, a news camera in front of somebody and these lying sacks are babbling their lies and nobody's there to, to dispute them. Where are you? Where are you when the bills are being voted on? Where are you when debate is happening in the House? Where are you? Well, we're going to get a, a, a good speaker in there to replace McCarthy, and that's going to fix all of this. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's gone really that. well, hasn't yeah, it? it? sure has. And then Thomas really Massey well. was going back and forth on Mike Johnson's stuff yesterday. Mike Johnson was trying to make it so that uh, he basically uh, cemented his uh, speakership, and he couldn't get vacated there. And uh, Anyway, mm -hmm. um, didn't have the mm -hmm. votes, and mm -hmm. so... Yeah, well, part we'll of the problem is these guys have been there way too long. Yeah. They're making way too much money. Um, the rest of us learned from an early age that the way you make money is to work hard, apply yourself, and, you know, maybe get an education along the way and apply what you learned. And, you know, just take advantage of the liberty and the freedom we have in this country. But really, the easiest way to do it is just get elected to Congress and uh, do some insider trading. <laughs> I mean, that's for real. Yeah, it is for real. That's for real. Yeah. You go into office, you know, you might be a, an $80,000 a year type person. You leave office, yeah, multi, multi, multi-millionaire. And sometimes more than that. I mean, look at Nancy Pelosi's net wealth. Uh, she and her husband uh, has ballooned, like, I think it's $146 million since she got into office. Wow. Mm -hmm. On a salary of $175,000, that's really good. Very fortunate with investments. <laughs> very, very, very fortunate, fortunate with investments. 